All right, ladies and gentlemen, so you are at the point where you need to save. So I'm doing this video to show you how and where to save your file so that you can find it no matter what computer you're on next class. So first, you're going to hit File, Save, and then you're going to make sure that the format is PXD. It's originally going to come up with the format JPEG, which I'll show you in just a second as soon as this loads. It does take a couple seconds to load, so you may need your I'm going to give you plenty of time to watch this video and get saved. So it's going to say JPEG. You don't want JPEG. You want it to be a PXD, a pixelar layered image. So once you select that, it's going to give you working. Make sure your name is here and it's not untitled. So make sure it says your first initial last name card. So if you didn't follow the directions in naming your card image, make sure you fix that now. And then you're going to click OK. Now where you save it is important. So you are not going to save it to desktop, you are not going to save it to libraries, you are not going to save it to the computer. And let's make this a little bigger so you can see better. You're going to go to network. On network, uh oh, okay there we go. It's just taking a second to load. On network, or wait maybe it's computer. It is computer. Sorry, my bad. So you need to go to computer. But you need to go to the network location for the computer, and you need to go to your name. So your named file. Then here you might have a whole bunch of folders and you might not. If you have a documents folder, put it in the documents folder. If you don't have a documents folder, like I don't, you're just going to click New Folder. And you're going to label this folder Playing Card. And then you're going to select it and click Open down here. Now this file is empty and that is where you're going to save. And it's going to save that directly over to there. So that shows you how to save. Now if you've pulled any other files, if you have any other image files and you need to drag them into that save file, you're going to go over here to your name. Then the same way. See how you see computer and then my name and then my playing card. Then I can drag any of the other images that I've used, if I've used anything else, into that file. Now if you're saving for the second time, like you've already saved into that file once, and if I go file save because I made another change before the end, once it stops working, when I click save, I'm going to save it in the same spot, and what's going to pop up is a little sign that says, do you want to replace? So if I click OK, and I'm going to click Save, it's going to say, it already exists. Do you want to replace it? So you always want to replace old files with new files. You don't want to just rename it as Chesser Card 1, or you're going to have 8 million files. So yes, you want to replace. So click Yes and then you know your newest file is on there.